agora. Motorists, pedestrians and homeowners are once again being urged against venturing into floodwaters. The bad weather is expected to continue until Friday and could potentially bring more devastation to the area. On October 5th, residents of Tobago and Northeast Trinidad are facing the full brunt of thundershowers associated with a fast-approaching tropical wave. Violet rainfall started at midnight, five hours earlier than was previously advised by the local meteorological service when yellow level was issued. As the system moves over the islands, gusty winds are also being reported. Flooding has been reported in parts of Chaguanas, Aruca, Tacarigua, Tunapuna, Sangre Grande, among other places. On the highway, between Trincity and Macoya, drivers also turned around trying to escape the floodwaters, creating a traffic pileup. In the residential community, Bon Air Gardens, streets began flooding in Phase 3, restricting movement for residents. Some businesses, among them a bar, also flooded out. Pleasant the day, guys. This is currently the situation in Lopinaruka. There was also incessant flooding, landslides, marooned vehicles, traffic as well as power outages in Roxborough and into St. George, Tobago.